Hey guys, so today I want to talk to you about a DVD and this is Things to Do Before You're 30. Now I'm not sure if you're going to have heard of this because anytime I ask somebody if they've seen it, they haven't even heard of it. So very few people know about this. I suppose the only reason you know about it is if you're a fan of any of the cast members or you remember seeing it coming out and things because I think it's such a shame. Um, I, like I said, I know nobody who's seen it and it's really quite upsetting because it's such a great um, film which I'll obviously talk about the plot and things in a minute. But if you have seen this, please let me know in the comments box. I'd love to know if there are people who've seen it or heard about it prior to this video. Um, but this is starring Billy Piper and four others. Uh, as you see, you've got Billy there. Um, that is the reason I bought it. In fact, I personally would have, wouldn't have even known it existed if it wasn't for the fact that Billy was in it. Um, so I'm pleased Billy was in it. You've also got um, Jimmy, Jimmy Mystery, Amelia Fox, Doug Scott and Sean Parks, as you can see on the line up there. Um, now this basically tells the story of a group of friends and things. They're not all friends, they're not like one big unit, but they're all connected in some way. And um, mostly that is your main characters, but you've got others. Um, like you see, there's the main fo focus is basically on a football team and these guys and how they connect with the female characters and things like that. And it's basically, they, they're sort of realising, they're obviously, they're coming towards middle age, they're getting on a bit. And they're sort of realising that now they have to sort of settle down and start being mature about things and take responsibility for their own actions. Um, and then they all have stories intertwined with that, which I won't tell you what they are, but it's sort of re it's them realising that they need to start, you know, stepping up a bit and being, well, being a man about things, kind of, which is really quite an interesting plot. It's definitely, definitely different from anything I've ever seen before. It is a comedy. Um... Yeah, and it's just so lovely. Um, like I said, the cast is wonderful. Um, the two that stood out for me, obviously Billy. Billy definitely did. And then Degree Scott there stood out for me as well. He was fantastic. But then also Amelia Fox, who plays Kate. No, she doesn't. Yes, she does. She plays Kate. I was going to say, is it Kate or Katie? But it is. It's Kate. And she um, is actually Lawrence Fox's cousin, who, if you're a fan of Billy Piper, you'll know that Lawrence and Billy are married. They did at the end of 2007. That seems like ages ago. But yes, that's actually Lawrence Fox's cousin, which is really, really nice. Um, but the cast itself is all lovely. There are a lot of characters. Sometimes it can be hard to get your head around. Um, you'll know if you've seen some of my other videos that I don't like. I, I don't always really like films if there's like 10 main characters. Um, but because they're all so different, you do sort of start to understand it quite easily. So that's, that's fine. That's really not a problem. Um, it's directed by Simon Shore, who I'd not heard of before. Um, went on his IMDb page, and he hasn't done that much, um, which is a shame because uh, the directing is lovely in here. It is so lovely, well, lovely, lovely, well. It's so well produced and love, 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 lovely. I can't speak. Um, so well put together. I'll stay clear of the word lovely. Um, but it is. I mean, it is really, really lovely. I can't do it, can I? Um, Billy's character is called Vicky. Um, and I, she's a fantastic character. She's probably, um, if you if you're, I suppose if you're male or walk that way kind of thing. Um, Billy does have a, a lesbian scene in there, but um, if you're looking for that sort of thing, you're probably better watching Secret Diary. And um, but do watch Secret Diary either way. It is fantastic. I love it. But that's aside from this. So yeah, it's definitely worth buying if you can. Prices I can't remember, but you're looking at about six pound. It's not a lot. I got this from Amazon. I don't think it's available anywhere else that I've seen. Um, eBay, probably. Probably eBay. Um, maybe HMV. Um, I've never seen it in store. I think I saw it once in WH Smith, but that was like five years ago. It was released in 2004. Um, so it is, it's a little old now. And it is a 15. I also have to point that out as well, which it says it's because it contains strong language and sex. It does. There's also a scene where the footballers are in the shower. So it's quite full on. <laughs> I've got um, the glass plastics on YouTube and the cast just sat on the laptop. Um, so if you can hear that. I'll actually be doing a video about that song in a minute. Um, for like, today actually. That video will be going up today and this one will be going up tomorrow. But, <laughs> Tisha, sorry. <laughs> so this is definitely worth getting hold of if you can. Sorry, it's really off-putting when you've got music in the background. Um, yes, this is a lovely film. 
definitely worth buying if you can because it's not that expensive. If you're a fan of any of the main cast members, then that's obviously a bonus reason to get it. But like I said, I bought it because Billy was in it. And if you're a fan of Billy, do get it. It's lovely. You will love it. I mean, it looks attractive as well. Um, really, really attractive DVD. Um, really eye-catching. The plot is fantastic. Characters are lovely. Um, Billy is fantastic in it. Well directed. Well scripted. Um, really, 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 really good. And just definitely worth buying all around. So please feel free to leave comments and things. Um, if you've got it, and like I said, if you've seen it before or even just heard of it, please let me know because I feel like I'm the only person in the world who has seen this, which is obviously not true. Um, I think that's all I want to say about that. I'm going to go and throttle my cat, so I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.